everybody. Today I'm going to review the Knipex Minis, which is a two-piece set, including a pair of the 125mm Cobras, which is the smallest pair that they make, and then a pair of the 150mm pliers wrenches, which is also the smallest pair that they make. Now they come together in this nice Velcro pouch that does include a belt loop, so you can keep it right on your side. And they're really designed to just be a good overall set for really anybody, whether you're a mechanic, electrician, HVAC tech, a plumber, or anybody else. Both of these are really going to be able to give you a lot of versatility out in the field, and they're going to do completely different functions. Now the pliers wrench, because it does feature those flat jaws that close in parallel with each other, they're going to be able to not only straighten out sheet metal, but they're going to be able to push in bushings, they're going to be able to really give you an extreme amount of clamping force which is a 10 to 1 ratio whenever you use these. Now the Cobras on the other hand have extreme grip. So what we're actually going to do is try this out on the Cobra test stand to see if it's actually going to hold up my weight or if it's going to slip. Now I originally saw these back at SEMA in Las Vegas last year and I got to tell you, at first it looked just like something that would be a novelty. But after seeing them in action and seeing them put to the test, they really are impressive. So next let's take a closer up look at both pairs of pliers and then we're going to see how they actually perform. To give you a better idea of how small the minis actually are, I have a full size pair of the standard Cobras here in the middle that are actually 250 millimeters or roughly 10 inches long. When we compare that to the pliers wrench minis, they're coming in at 150 millimeters or 6 inches long. And then finally the Cobra minis are actually coming in at 125 millimeters or 5 inches long. So that's literally half the length of a standard pair. Now here's a closer look at what you're actually going to get in the kit. You are going to get a pair of the Cobras, a pair of the pliers wrenches, and then that small little Velcro pouch. And you can see it does have Knipex embroidered on the front. And it also has a belt loop on the back so you can really keep it with you at all times. Now inside, you can see it will just Velcro open. There are two different actual little pockets inside. So you can see we can take the Cobras, slip them in the rear. We can put the pliers wrench right in the front or vice versa. Close this up and we're going to be good to go. Now because they did design these to really be with you at all times, they included this little case that does have that belt loop on the back. So you can see I can pop it right on my belt. I'll slide it right behind my front pocket so it's not in the way, put my belt back on, and then it really looks like a cell phone case on your side. So let's say you're a technician, either an automotive technician, HVAC, or a plumber, you can keep this right on your side, and then when you need either a pair of Cobras or pliers wrenches, you can open it right up, pull out the pair you need, and everything's going to be stored right on your side. Here's a closer look at the pliers wrenches and you can see that other than the size they are going to be completely the same as the larger pairs. Now this is down to including the operation because all you need to do is press in on this button right here and that's going to allow you to open and close them and then when you reach your desired level all you need to do is go ahead and let go of that. They're going to lock into place and then they're going to be ready to go. Now the real nice thing about pliers wrenches is the fact that they do have smooth jaws on the bottom as well as the top and that's not going to mar any fasteners you're working on. And then the best feature is going to be the fact that the jaws do open and close in parallel. So if you watch the bottom jaw, you can see that it's going to open and close completely evenly the entire way across and that's going to give you even pressure across the entire surface of the jaw. Now when you open and close this, that's going to give you a 10 to 1 cam action. So really for every pound of force you put on this, it's going to clamp with 10 pounds of force. So if you clamp with 50 pounds of force, it's going to clamp with 500 pounds of force. So it really does multiply your power considerably whenever you use these. Now let's say you want to use them to loosen or tighten an air fitting on let's just say a standard air tool. So what I have here is a small air impact ratchet. We're going to go ahead and remove the fitting on the bottom of here. And the other thing I want to point out about the pliers wrench, because it will latch on and then you can twist it, you can just slightly loosen up your grip, it's going to rotate and have a ratcheting sort of effect. So you don't have to remove this and then slide it back on like you would with a normal wrench. This can get into some very tight places and you're not going to constantly be fighting with it to loosen or tighten the fastener you're working with. Now the other nice thing about the pliers wrench, because the jaws are completely flat and they close in parallel with each other, you can actually use these to straighten out sheet metal. So what I have is just a standard piece of sheet metal. I'm going to go ahead and bend the end in 
And you can see at this point, let's say you dropped it or somebody bent it, it would be completely unusable. So, I mean, we can actually put just a few bins in here to really mess it up. And I'll show you, if you were trying to work with this, let's say you were trying to weld it, this piece would be completely unusable at this point. But what we can actually do is take the pliers wrench, we'll go ahead, just clamp it on the sheet metal, and then moving along the edge, it's gonna straighten it completely back out. And it does this very fast. All we need to do is just go back and forth. The pressure that you're putting on there, like I said, is gonna be a 10 to one ratio. And very quickly, you can take that piece of sheet metal that was just really bent up, and you can put it back to a usable state in just a matter of seconds. Now, just like the pliers wrench, the Cobras are gonna be just a miniature version of the larger sizes, but the functionality of the design as well as the operation of them is gonna be completely the same. Now, you see this button right here. All you'll need to do is press that in. That's gonna allow you to open and close the pliers, and then when you get to your desired level, you can just let go, and they're gonna be locked into place. Now, the real nice thing about Cobras is the fact that they can lock onto something and all you need to do is press down with downward pressure on the top of the handle here and you don't need to squeeze them the entire time. So it's going to really reduce your fatigue and they're going to be doing the work, not you. Now, what's also real nice is the fact that those jaws are hardened. They're not going to strip out and ruin after just minor use. These are really designed to last for the long haul and I have done some test videos as far as the Cobras versus is the Irwin Groove Locks if you want to check that out and see how these will hold up compared to other brands. Now let's go ahead and do a test with them to see how they're actually going to perform compared to a standard pair of Cobras which could hold my weight up on the Cobra test stand. What we're going to do is use these Cobra Minis which are only 125 millimeters long. I weigh 175 pounds and I intend to clamp that down on the test stand and then stand on top of these with my full weight to see if they're going to slip. Now for an extreme test with the Mini Cobras, I'm gonna go ahead and take the Cobra test stand, place it directly onto the concrete, and then I'm gonna latch onto it with the Cobras. So once we go ahead, clamp down with some force, it's gonna lock into place, and at this point, I can just press down on the top of it with all my weight and it's not gonna move. So you can see I'm pressing down with force, but to really put it to the test, I'm gonna stand on top of the pair of these now. Now, the only thing really touching and preventing me from falling off is the jaws of the Cobras latching into the metal part of the test stand. So here we go. I'm gonna go ahead, step on the top of the Cobras with all my weight. You can see my other foot coming up and I am completely on top of the Cobras now. I am a good two feet away from anything and I just have my finger on the ceiling to balance me to keep me from falling off of here. But all of my weight is on the Cobras and they're not slipping at all. So that is just absolutely amazing. They're still locked in and then to release them all we need to do is just lift up slightly on the top of the handle and they're going to fall right off. So now you've seen the Knipex Minis for yourself. And I gotta tell you, those Cobras being able to lock into the Cobra test stand, hold up my entire weight and not slip off is just extremely impressive. Now when we look at the pliers wrench, it does have a maximum of a one inch capacity when it's fully closed. So if you really wanna work on anything, this is gonna be able to lock onto that, especially plumbing fittings. And you're gonna be able to put a 10 to one ratio because the jaws are smooth, you're not gonna damage anything and it's not gonna let go because it's putting even pressure across the whole face of the jaws. Now these are both 100% made in Germany and they do carry a lifetime warranty through Knipex against manufactured defects. So if you ever do have a problem with them, they will replace them for you free of charge. If you like this video, please click like. If you like my channel, please click subscribe. And thanks for watching.